I don't know how to change my display. Sorry, I have this shower running in the back. My hair looks like I'm like out of a historical drama, but it's just clipped up. But then my front pieces were getting really, really annoying at the gym. So then I like tuck them in like this, but it is Monday. It is the start of the new week, probably the start of a new vlog. Um, I think I'm just gonna get back. Instead of like freaking out about editing, I think I'm just gonna focus on just filming and then worrying about the editing later. So start of a new vlog, new week feeling good went to the gym they were fresh did some boxing which was like super nice i can't get over how my hair looks right now so please ignore if i'm like doing the most but um yeah busy day today i have this like open house sort of thingamajigger for like three hours i am going to take a quick shower then i'm going to make myself some lunch and then i'm going to do that and then it's such a nice day outside that I'm probably gonna go out and like enjoy the weather and I just I still want to be productive and get work done so I'm probably just gonna be charged up and like take my work outside or today may be like a time where I'm like doing a lot of work in the evening I will just go about my day I want to be three o'clock go out and like do some reading and stuff like that so I don't know feeling good yeah I just I just feel very good getting my work out in because I'm in this weird struggle of trying to find a balance of how to do that but we're just gonna leave it at that so I don't like go on ranting like too much and I will check in with you guys next time say goodbye to pretty friend say bye bye ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> she's like get the fuck off but it's honestly just very busy more in the morning time um and then hopefully it will calm down more in the afternoon but i have two auditions today i have my first live audition today which is like definitely scary because everything else i've been doing i can do on my own so that will be interesting and fun um i've received some callbacks for being in other stuff so that's like super exciting so hopefully all that is like finalized today but everything's going well I'm just I feel like in such a weird way and I probably talked about this a lot and sometimes it's hard actually getting to this place but just trusting that I'm on the right path and everything's gonna work out so I think it has allowed me to take the rejections in a better way and take these other opportunities and really like feel good about them so I'm very very excited and it is like hella bright so i just wanted to say that say good morning i just washed my face so it's probably i need to lotion it so i'm gonna take it and brushing my teeth god this hair is killing me it is a couple hours later it is very nice outside well apparently it's like 60 I need to be accurate it is 63 degrees 10 mile per hour wind so it's so windy but because I have some walking around to do, I want to actually attempt just going out in just a hoodie. Every single time, although it's been nice, I still brought my long coat because it's still a winter 64, a transitional 64 where it's not like, oh man, it's hot, I'm sweating. But there's still some breeze and it's so cold. But then what happens is once you get to walk in a bit, I end up sweating and I'm like dying. So I'm going to wear my Chamberlain hoodie. Ooh -hoo. and just some leggings and we are going to try it out i am nervous because if there's one thing i hate being i hate being cold we're just gonna see and if i'm too cold then we'll just i'll just walk have to walk faster i guess to the store we go i finished my auditions for the day my eyes were hurting so bad i like had to take contacts out let's just ignore this look it's just like in a clip and then my clip just broke but other than that everything's going well so far today which is amazing i've got some stuff i'm gonna be doing so i am going to finish this up i need to run to the store that and then i'm going to do some outreach stuff it's like all oh, so exhausting but so exciting at the same time 
I'm feeling tired, but excited. Yeah, I really need to figure out headshots though. It's like, save money. I really do not want to pay for headshots. One, I really don't want to pay for headshots because they're expensive as fuck. Well. Two, I'm kind of debating, oh, should I wait till I'm in it a little bit longer than pay for it, right? That's a lot of people's, or some people's argument is find the cheapest way possible until you're at the point where you're like, okay, I really need nice ones. But then you also wonder if I do also have nicer headshots, how many more people would also be more interested in even just giving me the opportunity. Also, if you don't know, I'm also a photographer. So you would think on that and oh, just take it yourself. But it's like, I could definitely take photos of myself, but to give that full headshot look with all the lighting and the retouching, that is a skill that I lack and that is equipment that I lack. No idea what the fuck to do. I am, it's one of those situations where if you look at things as investments, it's definitely 150% worth to pay for it and stuff and to have that set up. Cause especially some people, really good people are booked for a while. So it's not even a situation like, oh, I'm gonna get these next week. Like, you just want right now, I'm reaching out to people and they're like, I'm booked for March and April. So you're getting in May. And it's like, by the time May comes along, the way I see it's going out, I definitely would really like some headshots. So, but yeah, that is why I'm just like, it's so exhausting. It is so, 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 so exhausting. Anyway, thanks for listening to my little rant. I have no idea where this vlog is or how this vlog is going right now. All I know is that Pretty Print is walking around here. I am feeling good and fatigued at the same time. And I need to continue on with my day and figure out what the fuck it is I'm gonna do. I have other things to prepare. Like I said, I have tons of shit to do. So we will check in later. I'm probably gonna take off my makeup because yeah, as much as makeup can give you that boost, it's like, I'm ready to clean this shit off. I'm only, the only reason I'm hesitating is because if there's a situation where I get another opportunity and I need to film something. So, I don't know. I've been talking way too long, although it's only been like four minutes. This is when I'm just talking and this is me just doing my normal little vlog shit. So, yeah, goodbye. Check in later. Do and goodbye. Oh my god, sorry. I know I keep saying every time I open the camera, I look at my hair, I'm like, what the fuck? But it's like, I think because I have this middle part and it's like hella thick and my hair is too, to like lay down and do one of like these numbers. Like, oh, like I've got a little couple baby hairs and it's like clipped back right now. But like, I love the transitional period to when it's getting warmer because it's exciting that it's getting warmer. But then it's also so hard because you're still trying to figure out how you can like go outside. But like I said, today was a good day. I obviously took off my makeup. And of course, you know what I said to myself? I was like, you know what? I think I said this earlier. I was like, I should keep my makeup on just in case someone wants me to do something. Cause maybe I can just knock everything out and like get it done early. And of course I like took a break, was working on other stuff, <laughs> came back to my computer and checked and I got <laughs> another request that I was like, right when I took off my makeup. But the thing is, is like, I can't be afraid to film myself without makeup on. It's not that I'm afraid. I think there's more of the nervousness of losing opportunity because someone can't see me fully in the role because I just look like this. But obviously if your talents or whatever shines through, it doesn't matter. But I think it's like extra bonuses, right? It's just hard because I, I'm someone who's at risk of getting cyst on my eyes and I and for so long especially going to college like in high school I used to wear makeup like every single day like you would not catch me at school without makeup I think first time I wore no makeup to school I mean obviously freshman year I didn't really wear it because I wasn't allowed to <laughs> really wear it until I think end of freshman I think for my birthday freshman year I was taken to Mac and I was able to like kind of start doing stuff but it, it was one of those situations where it's like you can wear this but you can't wear that so by the time sophomore year came, I was like just, you know, wearing makeup. And ever since then, I was wearing it like every single day. I was a girl who was wearing it during games. Um, but I feel like in high school, a lot of people do that because you're not gonna like go the full day of school and then wipe off your face because it's right after school. But yeah, I wore it like all the time. And then college, I saw a lot less, you know, combination of depression, student athlete life, and not giving a shit. And also environment, like people weren't really getting dressed at school unless you were like, 
yeah, not a student athlete. But yeah, so I stopped wearing makeup. Now I'm in this habit of like, I don't wear makeup. Like, especially if Joe and I go out to eat, I usually like don't put on any makeup on, which there's nothing wrong with it. Like, you should be able to feel comfortable. Sometimes I'm like, damn, I like really just like don't get ready anymore, do I? And so I want to make sure I don't like, my skin doesn't like really freak out because I haven't worn makeup in so long. That's like the only thing. And yeah, so I think I need to figure out, I think I'm, it's very short what they gave me, so I'm just gonna have to figure that out. I might honestly film with no makeup and say, hey, fuck it, and like put it in the thing of like, I don't know. Anyway, I'm talking too much. Like I said, it's like 60 something degrees, blah, blah, blah. It's 32, my phone's on 32%, which isn't the end of the world, but it's definitely gonna force me to stay off my phone. I'll, bit more and I'm just gonna run to the store and then I'm probably going to see if I'm feeling really good I might also go to the park because tomorrow's supposed to be raining so I want to make sure I get those good times outside so I'm not gonna lie I am extremely tired and ready to I'm literally ready just to run to the store come, oh my God, I literally look like a little boy but I'm ready to run back to run to the store and literally come back and just chill I feel like I've done a lot of talk in this vlog so I apologize I don't know how long this is gonna be. Maybe I'll end it after this and be like, sorry, today this was a chitter chatter vlog. But I feel like I had more of stuff to vlog than B roll because I'm kind of doing the same thing. I don't really know what to really B roll or how to make it interesting. And even now, it's like I wanna B roll like going to the store and like going to the park, but I feel like I really have shown that so many times. If I go to a different part of the park or it's another day, sure, but I don't wanna keep doing the same thing of like, putting my camera down, showing my little Nike sneakers walking because they're like so comfortable. Um, and then the city moving around, like, oh, it's getting warmer. Like, I don't want to keep doing that. So I think I'm just going to leave everything here. I'm going to take a book, maybe my journal. I'm just afraid I should have brought a jacket. I'm going to be like really cold, but if I'm really cold, I'm just going to do my trip and then come back. Okay, pretty much doing here with me. Oops. Okay. instrumental to the series or the movie that when there's a later time I come back everyone's like, ah! oh. like I'm the person where everyone the audience is going like yeah so like what what what, what character would that be anybody anybody that the world creates for you are you gonna be the next Kanye West I am Kanye 